business cycle has come about due to very specific years ago, there were specific sectors of the economy that certainly had cyclical ups and downs. And they would call it the business cycle of auto manufacturing, the big business cycle of construction, the business cycle of, you know, technology or whatever. And, and, you know, there, there was always uh, some truth to the idea that there is a cycle. Obviously, from, you know, April to October, the business cycle in construction is very good, you know. And so you go through these cyclical ups and downs in certain sectors. Well, somehow, some way that this, this term business cycle has gotten picked up as a general statement about the markets and the economy. Well, it's a business cycle. Well, what business? Which business are you talking about? Are you talking about the business of buying and selling? Um, So are we going through a cycle of buying right now? And that's why the markets are up? No kidding. Of course, that's why the markets are up. It says nothing about any underlying fundamentals, though, that are creating this so-called cycle. And there's the problem. So if you say, well, the business cycle, if, if, if the business cycle looks good, well, that means, you know, the business of buying stocks looks good right now, this morning, because we're seeing everything up. So that business cycle looks pretty good. Uh, so all I can say about it is it's almost a comical term. You've never, ever heard me use it, nor will you ever hear me use that term, uh, business cycle, because it's a misnomer. It is not... It, 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 uh, there's no logic behind saying it or using it. Uh, there may be some logic some, to somebody sitting up on Wall Street, and it's probably a logic of making money or not making money.